you don't keep you don't keep standing in your surrender or how can you keep surrendering when you've already done it? Are you surrendering now or have you surrendered by coming up? You have. See? That spiritual awakening right there, realizing that something that you have already done, you have surrendered. Lord's going to help you with some things. Ooh. Feel the anointing? Do you? Take it. Woo! In Jesus' name. So surrender. See, I'm waiting. That's what I want. I'm tired of theory without manifestation. She come up here by substance, and now she got. She just felt essence, and it's all over her. That's another teaching. I want to tell you something. When we surrender, now the government is on my shoulder. Mm -hmm. I'm not worried about what God's going to make me or ask me to do or where He's going to send me because He's already went before me. He's already covered the rear. And anything coming from the side, I'm already dead. My life is hid with Jesus and Him. And what's going to get on me? If, if something wipes out this body that I'm walking around in, so be it. I'm going to a greater and a better place and I can start my next session uh -oh. of God uh -oh. in that dimension. Uh -oh. And I won't be hindered by the natural things. But God said He's not done with me here. So I'm not going to worry about what's going to happen to me. I'm not afraid of death. She's alright. She's alright. Just let her cook. God, God never changes His mind. This has always been in the Scripture, but what happens until you can see it? People can't hear it. People can't partake of it. People don't know how to apply it. So we, we, go, we go without it. Our life keeps cycling and cycling and cycling and cycling. Keep cycling and cycling. That's your bride. That's what I said. <laughs> Are you getting anything out of this? Did I lose you on that last little bit? No, no. Okay. What did Paul say in 1 Corinthians 2? That my teaching and my preaching was not with enticing words of human wisdom, mm -hmm. but in demonstration of the Spirit and power. Mm -hmm. We've had demonstration of the Spirit and power already this morning. God is serious about this. Some of you have sit here in this in this ministry and you felt the anointing and said wish I could have what the apostle has wish I could have what the prophet has guess what you already do you already do you don't have to be a prophet you don't have to be an apostle you just have to be a believer mm -hmm. you just have to be a believer the government will be upon his shoulder. How would you like to walk around knowing that the government's on your shoulder? It's okay. You got a release, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. That's just the beginning. How would you like walking around with this knowledge? The government's on your shoulder. Yes. Wherever you step. What did it say in Joshua chapter 1? Wherever the soul of... Yeah. Treads upon, I have given to you. Okay, now it's past tense. Joliet belongs to you. But do you know how to exercise yourself in government? So when we walk, when we walk, when I say walk, I'm talking about well, how you live every day of your life. I've cut television completely out, almost completely out of my life. I watch TV. I turned on the weather channel. I don't know how I got on there last night. <laughs> I was in the hotel. 
And this man blessed me with a room. And I start crying. Just blessed to see you, man. You just don't know. But I don't know how I got on the Weather Channel. And they, they were they were had this program on and they were showing programs of heavy rescue. These big old tractor trailers had wrecked. One was turned upside down, and they were they have these huge rotator wreckers. I was watching that, and I hit the timer. It was watching me. <laughs> the TV was off when I woke up. I had bed clean this morning. It's like lint gets on you clean. I had bed clean. I didn't want to get up. I was tired. But I think about. I think about my walk with God. I keep my face in His face mm -hmm. all the time. The only thing I'm concerned about is what, what's in the heart of my Father. That's it. I, come on now. This ain't religion. This is, this is relationship. Mm -hmm. My Father. How many of you love your daddy? And you just love to be in his face? You love for him to, to talk to you and... and there comes a point in, in time in your relationship where it's not father ruling a son or, or a daughter, but now you've become friends because you've matured to a level where now you can be friends. Jesus said, a servant doesn't know what his master does, but he said, you're not servants, you're my friend. So I'm going to let you know what's up. Come on. Right. See the government's on our shoulder, so and see you gotta you gotta let the Holy Ghost, who's the author of this book, yes. tie it together. And yes. if you don't let him tie it, you're gonna run into some dead end streets, and you're gonna run into frustration. Yeah. <coughs> and I'm tired of going to church because it's the same old, same old. See that kind of thing comes out of the carnal mind, mm -hmm. doesn't come out of the mind of Christ. Yeah. See, we're here in a place of communion. We're, we're in communion with the Lord right now. I'm remembering Jesus. <laughs> Come on. Go. I'm remembering Come on. Him. Putting a finger back yes. on and a yes. shoulder joint yes. back into place and His yes. legs back under His body yes. and bringing healing to His body. His body is torn yes. apart. But God says... Do this in remembrance. Yes. In remembering me. It's more than just eating some little wafer and drinking some juice. Uh oh. You gotta walk in the juice. Mm -hmm. you gotta walk in the juice. Yes. I'm gonna quit here in a minute. No, you're doing good, brother. Yes. Yes. See, remembering. Some of you sitting here this morning, the anointing is already working on some hard spots in you. Yep. Yes. And he's trying to heal you. Yes. So you'll let it go. Yep. So you'll let it go. Do you know that there's an anointing on this ministry for this city? Yes. Am I stepping out in it now? Now, <laughs> prophet, <laughs> I, I know there's an anointing here, but I don't know about the city. <laughs> Do you live in the city? <laughs> Come on. Which one's more prominent, New Jerusalem or Joliet? It's going to suck Joliet right into itself. Yes. Does it take a whole lot of people to get something done? Mm -mm. I don't think so because God sent forth His Son, born of a woman made under the law, and He turned the whole world upside down. And he's still shaking it. Yeah. Yeah. He's still shaking it. He's still shaking it. He's still shaking it. Now he has to come back and shake the church till it wakes up. He's 
going to deliver us from ourselves. Yes. Well, uh, prophet, you're, you're not applying the word correctly. Yes, I am, because he told me exactly this is what he's doing in this hour. And we are resisting him because we're not feeling God like we used to feel him. He's not coming to me the way that he used to. He's not coming in the same anointing. It's yeah. not working anymore. But God is in the house and God is dealing with his sons. Why? Because Joliet needs to come. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. Now I'm going to make a bold statement. And I don't care if you believe me or not, because God has set me totally free from opinions of everybody. <laughs> <laughs> but God's going to bless me financially. Yes. Yes. And I want to sit down one day and write a check for at least $1.5 million. And put it in your hand because you're not in the right place. You're not in the right place. Does geographics have everything? Yeah, everything has everything to do with the kingdom because everything is involved and revolves by the kingdom. So God has to put us in a place. Well, we we just small blank turn to. People just ain't going to receive. <laughs> I, I ain't worried about what people think. Say that. Yeah. Say that. The only thing I'm concerned about is what God says. Yeah. Yeah. I don't have the vision of how. Uh -oh. come on. I do in part, but I don't have it. It's going to come through the, the visionary. Mm -hmm. yes. That's not my place. So I can have part of it. Yes. Mm -hmm. But, see, I, I haven't left anything. Yes. What are we talking about? He I'm sweating. Mm -hmm.